Number 68. Identify the type of crystalline solid, whether it's a metallic or network covalent, ionic or molecular crystalline solid, that's formed by each of the following substances, and in this case we have barium sulfate, which is BaSO4. What crystalline solid would this make? Well, just know that there's four different types, and I wrote down a little, you know, cheat sheet, little trick guide to help you guys out on your test or quiz coming up, if this is on that test or quiz. So I guess we'll just start from left to right. Metallic crystalline solids, the word metal is in the word metallic. So in order to have a metallic crystalline solid, you're just going to be consisting of a single metal, no nonmetals. But in this case, I have barium, which on the periodic table is in group two. So this is a metal, okay, but I have sulfur, and I have oxygen. Both of those are nonmetals. And I kind of see SO4, right? This is sulfate. Sulfate is one of those polyatomics. But I'll just put that here that, you know, sulfate is consisted of all nonmetals. So I don't just see a single metal, so this cannot be a metallic um, crystalline solid. Let's move on to the next one, ionic. Ionic crystalline solids form because they are ionic compounds. And from all the way back in the beginning of Gen Chem, ionic compounds are metal plus nonmetals, or if you see polyatomics. But here I have a metal, plus some nonmetals, or I could say that I have a metal and a polyatomic. This is definitely a ionic compound, and therefore, when it turns into a solid, when it freezes, it will be a ionic crystalline solid. And in this case, we do not need to proceed further. We've already found out what the answer is, so we'll just leave it as that. But just have the four of these crystalline solids in your back pocket ready to go for that next test or quiz. All right, it will help you out tremendously. And I hope you're doing great out there. Keep studying hard. I believe in you guys. Good luck on your future tests and quizzes. And I'll be talking to you soon, all right? Thank you for coming here. And uh, thank you for being part of the community. So hope you're doing well. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.